So we are heading into the Cheesecake Factory for our evening meal. And this is at the Mall of Millennia in Orlando. And there's the entrance to the mall, just there. And if you want valet parking, it's just there. Nice one. It's just been raining actually, but it's just stopped. And it's cooled right down. As you can see, the clouds look a little bit gnarly. But yeah, it's nice. They got the menu outside as well, if you want to see the menu, because it is huge. Absolutely huge, and there's no way I'm going to go through all that. But they've got, you've seen it in our other videos, loads of burgers, loads of seafood, pasta, and steaks, all kinds of stuff. And average price of the meals is around, I would say, 16 to 17 dollars so yeah if you want to check out their website you'll get a full menu on there but there's all kinds of stuff on there we'll put a link to the menu but yep a lot let's head on in you've got some outdoor seating which is uh, quite nice and then as you go in you've got the waiting area on the right and the left got the cheesecake bar on the left this is where they'll check you in they got a sports bar over there and they, it's quite dark we've said this before and this one is quite a dark cheesecake factory kitchens at the back and you've got another seating area over to the left and you've got the cheesecake to go bar just here check out these cheesecakes banana cream there chocolate mousse cheesecake look and they got the calories as well you don't want to look at those but they look amazing absolutely amazing and they'll make it all up for you there and then you coat it there I think the slices are around eight dollars each something like that so yeah all that good stuff so as you can see we are sat outside and it's quite nice here, we're right at the end of the seating area and it's uh, pretty awesome it's nice and um, warm, it's not too hot don't burn your fingers on that fake candle wearing it oh my goodness wow, it's fake, who'd have thought it eh? fake candles fake candles welcome to the 21st century so the drink of choice for Pippa is a Sauvignon Blanc which one? Uh, which one? Mature. And I've gone for a blue moon because I don't do Sam Adams here anymore. And Erin, what have you gone for, Erin? A Jack Daniels and a Coke, yeah? Just a Coke. Nice. As always, they bring you out the bread, which is like a sourdough bread and a whole, what would you say that? It's like a malt kind of malted seeded bread. And it's always yummy. Looks like they've uh, reduced the portions since last year, but you can ask for more. Yeah, you can ask for more. But yeah, don't fill up because otherwise you won't eat your meal. So this is my meal. It is the Louisiana chicken pasta. Comes in at 2,100 calories and looks pretty damn amazing, but is huge. Plate is boiling hot. Look at that. Pippa has gone for the skinny medallions, which skinny, is skinny licious. Skinny licious. Medallions. Beef medallions. Steak medallions. Looks nice. Got a bit of asparagus, tomatoes, mushrooms, and the medallions in the middle. And mashed potato underneath. I think we should have just gone for what Erin decided to have, which is a massive bowl of um, pasta. Bowl? Plate? Well, it's a small bowl. It's a bowl, actually. It's a bowl, not a plate. But yeah, that is a big portion for kids. So, uh, as you can see, it's Erin's head. Look at the size of it compared to her. And you need to eat that all up. Every single last piece. Otherwise, you're not getting in the pool tomorrow. <laughs> right, let's get stuck in. We'll let you know what it's like. We've not had this before, so... Yep. Looks good. So, I didn't really describe what the Louisiana chicken was. It's um, southern fried chicken and it's in a pasta sauce it's got mushrooms a creamy sauce 
It comes in at a whopping 2,100 calories. It tastes amazing, but I don't know if I'm gonna eat it all. There's a lot of chicken on here, but we'll give it a go. So I'm probably nearly halfway through it. It is really, really good. The mushroom sauce on that is really nice. The chicken is beautifully cooked, moist, and very tender. Pippa, what's your uh, medallions like? Good? Yeah, it's really nice. Yeah. The vegetables are really fresh and crisp and lovely. Yeah, the steak cooked medium, so yeah, I'll just try it a bit. It is really, really nice. I wish I'd gone for that, to be honest with you. Uh, I'm starting to feel the old um, belly waistline getting a bit tight, so uh, we'll see if we get through it. And you're pasta, and you're doing well, aren't you, really? Bless you. Yeah, it's a massive bowl of pasta, that, but slowly but surely I think I'm done I, I'm, yeah I want to save some room for some cheesecake because we never get cheesecake when we're here so I'm gonna leave it I don't want to burst the old button off the trousers so yep defeated the Piva demolished hers because it's a very small and light meal Erin didn't finish hers which is expected but it is a huge amount of pasta for a kid. It was like a volcano bay size, wasn't it? It was huge. So the bill's come in. We've just ordered some cheesecake as well. So we've added that to the bill and it came to a total of 73.65, which we didn't think was too bad. That included the, um, the Blue Moon and the Sauvignon Blanc. So yeah, not too bad. Happy with that. And we'll show you what the uh, Schmores cheesecake looks like right now and that's the cheesecake we went for which was a schmores cheesecake big dollop of cream and it looks delicious I dread to think how many calories are in that but it looks yum cheesecake factory done